All right, we are back with Zoo Tycoon 2. Uh, yeah. So, here we go. Next campaign game. So, last time we finished up the Shark World scenario uh, in Zoo Tycoon Complete Collection. And I will admit that I, uh, I don't exactly mm, feel really good about, you know, how we left that. You know, I mean, it was just kind of like, uh, you know, you're done, and then I was like, what, I'm done? And they're like, yeah, I guess. And so then I was like, okay, I guess. And then I was just kind of like, you know, so, um, yeah, but, um, but then actually I, I went back, you know, to, uh, you know, I guess, to visit. And then, uh, I found this, so, you know. Sharks thriving definitely sounds good, you know, and it says on the way to, you know, here, camp, you know, I mean, working towards, you know, and also the photo booth unlocked. So that's, that's very interesting, very cool. We'll have to check that out in the future. But anyway, for now, here we go, the Secretary Bird, which is the second scenario of the African Adventure Campaign in... West Africa. This is Mauritania. Not to be confused with Mauritius. Mauritius is somewhere over here. It's a small island. Now this... This is Mauritania. I think. Anyway, the Secretary Bird. Can you capture the behaviors of this long-legged predator on film? Complete all the scenarios in its campaign to unlock desert-themed building and objects. Yes, the Secretary Bird, which we have had a couple Secretary Birds before in our city zoo, but I do love the Secretary Bird. It's an excellent bird, and not actually named after secretaries, as you might expect. In fact, it's just named, I believe it's a similar, I don't know, it's like the word secretary is similar to its native name. So it's, it's like a, it's like the white rhino, I believe. You know, it's not actually called the white rhino. It's just the name in, you know, English sounds similar to its native name. Anyway, not important. The secretary bird is a common sight in the savannas and grasslands of Africa. Although these long-legged predators can fly, secretary birds spend most of their time on foot, striding over the landscape in search of lizards, insects, and rodents to feed on. The Raptor Protection Society helps protect birds of prey throughout the world. The society has donated a secretary bird to your zoo, which you will find crated near the entrance of your zoo. Uh, in exchange for the donation, the society wants you to take a series of secretary bird photos for the annual fundraising calendar. The first two photos the society would like are a photo of the secretary bird preening, uh, and a photo of the secretary bird flapping its wings. The Raptor Protection Society wants to increase public awareness of the secretary bird exhibit at your zoo. If you can attract a grand total of 75 guests to your zoo, the society will give you a $20,000 donation. So they are serious about protecting raptors. That's what it looks like. Um, yeah, so let us start. Secretary Bird Zoo. We renamed the zoo in honor of our secretary bird. So let us let us first just visit the zoo. So we've got some very cool cat desert statues or desert cat statues, whichever you prefer. There is our secretary bird. We will be building an environment for it shortly. Uh, it's a nice, very deserty zoo. Tiger fountain little guest area. What do we have in here? An okapi? Great. Very cool. I love this low jungle fence. And some chimpanzees! Right. Let us get a closer look at the chimpanzees. I mean, and the okapis. I, I do love the okapis. They're very very nice. I, I, I especially love this, you know, sort of Ditch area. No copy three. Some small poop. Oh, they were grooming each other. That is very cool. Alright. No. Come on. Ungulate poop. 
Oh, and they've got a nice waterfall and everything. All right. Um, and then let's go over here. We've got a savanna exhibit with some Thompson gazelles and zebras. Yep, that's all it appears to be. And lastly, I guess we've got a wetlands exhibit with, I mean, I heard some flamingos and, and a hippo, at least one. Yep, there's another one. Hippo, and we've got this area. Great! Oh, very nice, very nice. Alright. So, that is the zoo. So I'm thinking, since we've got that over there, I'm thinking we do the secretary bird over here. That seems like the best plan. Secretary bird one, female. I'm thinking... You know, actually, we could make it, like, over here. That might be... Let's see, topography. So we've got... We've got some pretty substantial hills over here. But we've got... I mean, that's that's a very substantial hill. But this, like, this could work. So, like, yeah, because if we, if we pulled it out, like, over here, then I think that could work. And I think we're just going to do wooden rail fence. Uh... Kind of something like this, or maybe. Hmm. Oh no 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 no! That's not what I want. I want path. What if? Hmm. Did something like this? No, something like. Well, hang on. Let's first... Yeah, let's first... Alright, so I think I want... So I, I'm, I'm thinking about not, like, making a full new octagon. Octagon? Yeah. Not a full new octagon, but, like, half an octagon. But I think I want it to be... No? Can I... I don't suppose it's going to let me do that, but it might let me do this. No, it's not. Um, well, I guess I'll just have to live with that. And then, yeah. I mean, that's that's not a problem. That'll be okay. Um, oh, sorry, guys. I did not mean to trap you like that. But, oh, look! There's a small little kangaroo rat type thing. Very cool. Um, thinking, should I? No, I, I don't think that'll be necessary. Um, and then, so I want it not quite, maybe that much? I mean, we've got $50,000, and presumably this is the only exhibit we need, so there's no reason to not spend lots of money. Okay, so actually, I do not want this. Yeah, that doesn't really look even, but I think it's just the angle that I'm on. Yeah, it is just the angle. And then I'm going to bring this out... Let's say 45, and so that'll be 55. Although then it does look a little bit more bare, so... In order to, I mean, you know, just to fill it out. And then I think this will be good. Yeah. And then I'll put, like, something over here and something over there kind of... Ooh, or I could even put, like, a little bridge? That might be very cool. 
um, depending on the, well, honestly, I think creating an elevated path, while it would be really cool, would be a little bit more work than is necessary. Although, if I'm just waiting around for pictures, then I might have a lot of downtime. So maybe, you know, I could be hovering over here. You know, sort of working on the exhibit. Um, oh, copy two needs more space. Yes, you do. Yep, and you also. Yep. Copy three. Uh, what is the staff situation here? Chimpanzee, do we have any? Hmm. But uh, well, there was a ball in there. So, yeah right there. Small ball toy. Uh, but yeah, what's the staff situation? We've got one zookeeper. I think I'm going to get another. And so then, Keeper Laszlo can be assigned to the wetlands and the savannah exhibit. And then, Keeper Delamore can be assigned here, and I have not yet finished this exhibit, so I will not assign Keeper Delamore yet. And then, let's see, this is four, and that is one, two, three, four, five. I think one more for a total of six. And then that is one, two, three, four, five, so Five, and then that was four, and then that should be five. Excellent! Hopefully that exhibit is large enough. If not, I can always make it bigger. I will, of course, have to change the biome to grassland. Actually, maybe that exhibit is not big Let's get some dirt. Objects are now available for purchase, but maybe not that much dirt. Let's, let's make the hill mostly grass. And then get some nice... So for you, I feel like this is the only option. Uh, but I am going to give some big blue stem, like over here. And dandelions. Who doesn't love some dandelion? And then lots of June grass. So I'm a big fan of the June grass. Uh, any trees? Um, I don't think we need any trees. Um, and then maybe a rock. Or two. Maybe actually like three. Yeah, like there. Uh, we're going to need a staff gate. Right here. Food. Again, there is no reason for us to not spend money. Because we have great whopping amounts of it. Um, I will research the ball with rattle, because they already have a small ball toy, and there are no shelters. So here we go. How do you feel? Uh, biome is critical. Can I get a second opinion on that? There we go. Much better. How are you doing, Secretary Bird One? And what pictures do we need? Uh, preening and flapping its wings. All right. Looking at the food dish, standing. Actually, you know, I shouldn't have hired a second zookeeper. I should just be completely responsible for this exhibit myself, because I'm going to be standing over here most of the time anyway. Pooping. Oh, well, pooping on dirt, I mean, that's okay. Not exactly what I had in mind, but... Oh, but we're not supposed to groom it, because... Has... no. Alright, okay, here we go. Uh, secretary birds preen when their hygiene need is high. So we should not... Here, I'll get the ball with rattle. We should not...
should not clean the secretary bird at all. I don't know. I mean, uh, like, elevated path, sometimes it's way more of a hassle than it needs to be, so. What? What? We could get another animal. I could make a nice desert exhibit. We need some camels and some bird tortoises. Yeah, the chimpanzees are making a lot Oh, it was in the tree. That is very cool, very cool. Sleeping. Yeah, I can clean up the poop, but cannot groom the bird. I have to wait for the bird to groom herself. Oh, she needs a friend. When do secretary birds become available? Three stars. Ah, here we go. Many books derive the origin of the bird's name from a fanciful resemblance of its crest of a long feathers to a group of quill pens placed behind the ear, but the name is actually a mispronunciation of the Arabic name for the species. So there we go. It's a mispronunciation. Oh, and we need a donation box. Yes. Oh, well, there's one right there, actually. <laughs> uh, yeah, and people are definitely donating to Secretary Bird using that, so. Grooming, here we go. Wait, no. Ah. Is that really the best picture I got? No. That's the best picture. There we go. Secretary bird preening. Oh, really? We can't do? Then we will get rid of <clears throat> this space. After all, we don't really need that space. But yeah, see, there we go. Well, you know, we tried. And then that photo, we'll just keep in the camera roll because, you know, that's, that's what, it, what it thinks. So, did that work? Is it now hygiene totally satisfied? It is! Excellent! That is great news. So what about flapping your wings? I know you want to. Oh! What is that doing here? Looks like leftovers from a construction project or something. It's wandering. Alright, but we definitely do need something over here. Um, maybe some benches? See, the problem is this is like, you know, so I, I don't know about that one. But over here, you know, keep the bird in sight in case she starts flapping her wing. But, like some benches, like there. And then. Maybe, maybe like a pretzel cart or something? Well, what food do we have over here? We've got an ice cream cart, hamburger food stand, and water drink stand. I think, yeah, a pretzel cart would definitely not be remiss. Everyone loves pretzels. And then I will smooth this. Smooth terrain. There, is that smooth? It's that smooth enough. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there we go. She just likes running around. 
Maybe she needs a tree. In order to, you know, flap. Like, she'll flap to get up into the tree. Let's see. Like, if I could just... That. And then... That's a little bit more smooth. Maybe not a lot more smooth, but I don't know, flapping of the wings yet. But guests are coming. View like Amy S. Okada. Still just wandering. Yeah. Definitely needs a friend, but that won't be available for three stars. So, I suppose we could try and increase the star rating with- Oh, wait, 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 no! Oh, rats! For like half a second, and then done. Playing with the ball with rattle, that's very cute, though. But I saw she's running and... Flapping her wings. Oh, come on. Oh, copy one. Really? Are we doing this? How do they even manage to climb up there? Standing. Seeking privacy. Yeah, maybe privacy is not the best, but... There we go. Flapping wings. Alright, the Raptor Protection Society was quite pleased with your first set of photos. Now the Society wants you to photograph some of the Secretary Bird's more advanced behaviors. Uh, a Secretary Bird using a Pursuit Ball at two stars of fame, and a Secretary Bird stalking live food lizard. And then we still want 75 guests in the zoo. And a cash grant worth $10,000, which is a lot of money for those of us who didn't know that $10,000 was a lot of money. So we already have the live food lizard available. Which actually, now that I'm remembering, I'm pretty sure that stocking animals, possibly even including the live food lizard, actually counts as social. So that's good. Uh, but we do need to get up to two stars of zoo fame. So in order to do that, I am going to... make this desert exhibit. Yep. I think that's correct. Yep. Alright, and the best thing about a desert exhibit is the biome is already there. So then let's put a camel, a couple camels, uh, and let's give them some food. And water. Oh, you know, actually, uh, the tortoise needs grass. Um, yeah, that, those are, those are fine. Um, shade structure. Uh, staff gate. Ah, new objects are now available for purchase. Excellent. I'll still go ahead and get one tortoise. And then Greater Flamingo 1 is now pregnant. That is excellent. And the research for the live food lizard is complete. Let us begin the research for the pursuit ball. So, here is some live food lizard. I think you want to stalk it. Stalking the live food lizard. Yes. Now that's a good picture. Although, preferably, I would like to photograph the kill. No, we're not going to go for the kill. Oh, well.
going to poop. Did I put a staff game? Yes, I did. And I will assign the zookeeper to that exhibit. Where are you? Aha! Keeper Delamore. Common Zebra 2 is now pregnant. Grooming. Very cute. Yay! The research for the first ball is complete. I also, I think what I really want is I want some binoculars. That's, that's what I want. I want to put them right there. I mean, that's, that's what I want. Ooh, are you going to play with the pressure ball? No, I'm going to sleep in shade. Oh, have we unlocked? No. So there's, there's a really cool shelter. It's just, it's a nest specifically for the secretary bird. And it's like, it's just a small little, you know, nest type thing that you just, you know, put on the ground and it's like a tiny little tree with a little nest in it. But it's really cool and it's designed specifically for the secretary bird. And, you know, it's, it's just cool. I mean, in a secretary bird zoo, like I should have the secretary bird. It's, it's like the meerkat, you know, sentry post. It's designed for the meerkats, so. You know, in a zoo with meerkats, for meerkats, like completely about meerkats. It makes sense that you would want the meerkat sentry post, and it's the same sort of thing for this zoo. Now, I think I'm just going to leave the binocular stand there with no path. I think that's going to be fine. The guests will still figure out. See, you, Roger Lyon, he knows how to use the binocular stand. He doesn't need a path. Hiding in the big blue stem? That is so cool. I know that I don't need a picture, but... Oh, rats. Well, I tried. Yeah, oh, well, delete that photograph, yes. Although, I do like... This one? Or... Yeah, no, that one's, that one's a little silly. Yeah, here we go. Secretary Bird. Hunting, yes. And he's using the binocular stand, excellent. Should I add one on the other side? I don't see why not. I mean, I did the research, they're not that expensive. Aha, now you are going to play with the pursuit ball, I know it. I can feel it. Yes. Are going to play with the virtual ball. It's in your blood. No? Really? Oh. Well. Thinking about other things. Oh, we did unlock some more stuff. So I can put some flower posts here and here. Fountain might be nice, but they've already got the tiger fountain all set up at the beginning, so. I don't know if another fountain is really necessary. <laughs> Greater Flamingo 1 is going to lay an egg. Very cool, very cool. Stalking the live poop lizard. Well, I guess at this point we will just. Wait, wait until this secretary bird decides to play with the lovely giant pink fursuit ball that I have provided. So, you will just wait. Ah! We have more than 75 guests! Well, that's cool. And we received $20,000. So we now have $69,000. Alright, well, <clears throat> since we just made, you know... Now, I guess. Now we'll wait. <laughs> All right, we got it. The Raptor Protection Society was once again impressed by your secretary bird photos. The society would like just one more photo for the calendar, a secretary bird egg. Of course, 
Before you can take a photo of the secretary bird egg, you'll need to obtain a male secretary bird and then breed your pair. Hint, to encourage breeding, make sure all the secretary bird's advanced needs are met. All right. So that's it then. Oh wait, I'm gonna add this. I'm just gonna call it Ball Pursuit. It's a pun because it's called the Pursuit Ball. But we're pursuing the ball, so it's like the pursuit of the ball. So it's the ball pursuit. Anyway, uh, moderate pun notwithstanding. Uh, so, right, so I think that's good for now. So we are up to two and a half stars, and our hippopotamus gave birth while I was waiting. Um, there it is, baby hippo. Hippopotamus three. Yeah, it's very cute. Um, so, uh, I think, I mean, there is only one more photo, but, you know, I, I feel like, um, ooh, released a while. We, we can, we can improve on some of this number of species also. Um, but yeah, so I think, you know, in order to give this the proper, you know, attention it deserves, I think we will, uh, Yeah, I think we'll we'll call it done for now, and then you know pick back up, increasing the zoo star rating to three stars, and then getting a male secretary bird, and then and you know that can be a whole thing rather than you know just kind of quick at the end. Also, one of my chimpanzees is pregnant as well, so that's something to look forward to. Also, uh, anyway, so then that's all for now. So, adios.